officially a remake. Um, but if you ask me, it is it does it is a hybrid of of the two of the of, of Philip K. Dick's work and um, and, a little, and and inspired also by Verhoeven's film. And uh, I I had no interest in in remaking Verhoeven's film. Uh, and I, I I love that film. That film exists and it's out there and and we can all we can all watch that. So if I was to get involved with this, I wanted to be a different kind of experience. And I really what what drove me was the the, the concept of of recall itself. And in Philip K. Dick's novel about what just that that uh, that ability that you go in and you pay for um, an experience. He's not really happy with his life. He's a bit of a grease monkey worker that uh, just feels just that there's a tug that there's something more that he was that he was made for, and um, and it just it just nags at him. He thinks it's something just it, it's kind of reaching to him in his dreams and uh, can't can't quite settle. And doesn't doesn't mean about your life, and you inherently feel like a good guy, and all of a sudden everybody around you starts telling you that you're a bad guy, that you're inherently bad, but you feel that you have you, you're a good-hearted person, and what do you what do you do with that with that dilemma, and do you do you base it off of off of proof that people are showing you? So I know you feel like you're a good guy, but look at all this evidence, you're evil, you're bad, you're you know. Do you take that on and accept it, or do you fight through it because inherently what you, what you feel inside?